What's good, everybody? Corbino here, and we got ourselves our second The Office box. I don't know if the other two boxes were, I guess, three. Third? <laughs> Can't talk. I guess this is the third Office subscription box I've gotten, because I got that uh, buy one, get one uh, when I first subscribed last quarter. But anyway, so this is our second, like, regularly scheduled one, that makes sense. I don't know if the last box has said Peacock on it, but this one says Peacock. Um, it's, the picture is the Scranton uh, Business Park building. And then the back is a cork board, a little tack board. It's all right box, but let's see what goodies we got. I really enjoyed the last two, so I hope I also enjoy this. Um, I think I'm gonna go for the shirt, just cause I have no idea what this is here on the shirt. So let's, something about. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. Ryan started the fire. Oh, I am all for that. All for it. Feels comfy. It's got a funky smell. I think it's like the plasticiness here. I think that's. Yeah, it's definitely that. It's a little funky smell, but hopefully that'll, you know, go away in time. Um, right, what do we got here? Dwight painting tapestry. I don't know what that means. What's a painting tapestry? I don't know what that is. Oh, I think I see what it is. Okay, there we go. That's, I thought I knew what a tapestry was, but I was like painting, but it's supposed to be a painting. That's pretty funny, I like that. I wonder what the theme is this month, huh? I don't know. All right, whoa. Yo, this is Robert California. So I am all for it. Let's see, Robert California quote wine glass. Oh, I love me some Robert California. Not a wine drinker, but I will use it. Oh, it's just one of these. Yeah, I'm all for that. Yes. Do I look like someone who would waste my own time? Not my favorite Robert quote, but it still works. That is fantastic. Y'all know. Well, maybe not, but I love Robert, if y'all don't know that. Oh, that's fantastic. An umbrella of sorts. Oh, that's the little sleeve. The sleeve for it is just blue and has the office logo. And isn't it bad luck to open a uh, umbrella indoors or something? How do I? Okay, I was gonna say I haven't used the umbrella in years. Okay, so Dunder Mifflin got like recycling and uh, um, reams of paper or boxes of reams of paper. Assume y'all can see all that. God, I, I mean, I really never use umbrellas. I haven't, I don't know how these things open and close. All right, um, Dunder Mifflin wireless speaker, all for it. Let's see what we got here. Oh, falling down. Multi-purpose copy paper. So I, is it supposed to be, the design is supposed to be a ream of paper, I think. I mean, I'm for it, and that's all that matters here. I assume it works, but I really, I don't know, I might try to get it working here. One of those little things that like keep stuff dry. Okay, it's some type of, it's gym with, I'm assuming, a tuna sandwich. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's a lunch bag, I think. Yeah, it's a lunch bag. That's, that's nice, I like that. A little small, but you know. That's a nice big tuna lunch bag. And the Nard Dog. Epoxy print pen. What is that? Is that is that what these type of pens that they've been sending are? Because I know there's just you know basic pins and buttons and then you got like the enamel ones. 
Okay, that's reflecting too much. I guess we'll slide that out. If I can... There we go. I think that's actually what the tattoo is that Andy gets. Okay. Yes. A Creed notepad. Business and bow body. Okay, so just making sure it wasn't different things. Good, Kevin. Business and bow body. I love that. Uh, let's see if it's even. All right, let's see what we got here. What? No, what I said. Not a bad speaker at all. Definitely for it. What buttons we got here? Short press. All right, that's so that's play and pause. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah, definitely very nice. You got a USB back here. Okay, aux cord. Something for like an SD card. I don't know why. But uh, I'm gonna turn that off. Hey, let's see. Thunder Mifflin Umbrella, Ryan started the fire, Dwight painting, Creed Business, notepad, Big Tuna Lunch Bag, Andy Nard Dog Pin, Thunder Mifflin Wireless Speaker, and Robert California Wine Glass. Did I see something fall out earlier? Because it looks like this has a little springy to it, and I could have swore I saw that earlier. But I guess I'll look for it later, because I don't care that much. Um, oh, here's a, the cord for it. Um, anyways, I would have to say my favorite item is probably, mm, I don't know, they're all, like, it's not like anything's jumping out at me. Speaker's real cool. I love me some Robert California, but it's also like, how often will I use this? Because first off, it's glass. I don't want to break it. And I don't drink that much wine, but, you know, I can put other crap in it, for starters. Um, pen will be on my curtain of pins. Sure, if it fits nice, I'll definitely be wearing that. Um, notepad's great. Like, it's all good stuff. It's just nothing screaming at me. Like, nothing's really amazing, you know? It's all about the same level of awesomeness. Except for the umbrella, I would put that a little lower. Um, I would say my favorite thing's probably the Robert California Glass. Just because I don't know if I've ever seen Robert California merch before. You know, you got action figures pop figures mystery minis uh there's new like pop ones where they have words popping up mini like the little lego mini figs i mean, think they're a different brand but still you know you got all these shirts everything with office characters and i don't think i've ever seen robert california i love it all but i'm probably gonna have to say that the robert california glass is my favorite um was there not a theme or is it just scranton office part because robert i don't know Guess this is all kind of Scranton office park. So yeah, I mean Big Tuna technically started in Stanford, but uh, yeah, I guess this is all Scranton office park. So I'm for it. That's was that. There's a few things from various seasons here. I'm guessing that's themed because I don't see anything saying otherwise in the pictures. Of the Scranton office park. So I, I would think that's what it would have to be. Um, but yeah, real good box. If you guys love The Office like I do, I highly recommend subscribing to this box. I will let you know. I'll put that info down below. Also, a lot of people don't know they have Office action figures. Right now, I think they just have 
they released Dwight and Pam and then Michael a little after. I haven't seen Michael. I got Dwight at Ollie's. Um, but that was probably like... Dang, that was probably... Six plus months ago. So God knows if he'd even be at an Ollie's now. The Pam, I got a five below. And that was probably four or five months ago. But I just saw her still there. Like less than a week ago so if you guys have five below definitely go check that out see if you can get a pam figure haven't seen any michaels i they're just basic little basic little figures with like two different accessories and they have a quote coming off i recommend them if you're an office fan i got them both for super cheap uh i don't know how much they are at retail before you know going to ollie's or five below but i recommend them um, yeah, that's, that's it for this unboxing. Uh, yeah, until next time, Bo Body.